So now we're going to talk about the face fabric of the regatta garments. So um, obviously Matt we talked about in earlier videos that the uh, membrane is connected to the um, face fabric of the jacket. So why not just put the membrane as a face form fabric? Why do we need to protect it? Okay, so there's a couple of reasons here. And the, the practical reason is that the membrane is extremely thin and delicate. So if this was on the outside, if it got snagged by anything, say a thorn, thorn bush, it's going to put a hole in it and then it's not going to be waterproof anymore. So we put it on the, the inside of the garment and the face fabric, we call it the face, it's on the outside, um, protects that membrane or the coating. So it's there as a protection layer. Protection layer. Protect the membrane. Okay. Exactly. And the second reason, which isn't um, as practical, it's more for design aesthetics, is so we can use all sorts of nice different fabrics, different colours to make the jacket more um, appealing. If Obviously, we, if we didn't do that, then the membrane would all all waterproof jackets in the industry would look like this sort of membraney yeah. colour. On this on this jacket, we've got grey membrane, but they come clear as well, um, and coatings often clear. So uh, if we had uh, that look all the way on the outside of the coat, yeah, it wouldn't be as appealing. Right. 